Good morning guys. It has just gone 10 past 8 in the morning and I'm on my first call out for the day already. Um, I've got a lady out in the in Nanda sort of area, in Tezuma and Nanda. Um, she reports that she saw a very large snake in her house at midnight last night and uh, she said she just closed up the house and she went off to somebody else's place to, to sleep for the night. Um, she said the snake was in the bedroom, she saw it going underneath her bed. So it's a little bit of a worry because the snake has had the entire night, if it's a nocturnal snake, to cruise around and go wherever it wants and possibly exit the house. But what I'm hoping is that it's actually a diurnal snake that was settling in for the night and if that's the case it shouldn't have gone anywhere it should still be there um so yeah let's get there and uh see what we can find all right looks like we are just about there just going off the main road and onto this dirt road and it looks like her house is about I don't know, maybe 300 meters Continue away. straight. Then, your destination will be on the right. Okay, so these are not... Your destination is on the right. <clears throat> right. Apparently my destination is on the right, but... I'm not sure exactly where. Okay, so I'm basically just sitting in the car waiting to see where this woman's going to pop out from. I've sent her a photograph of the houses that are in front of me here and asked her which of these properties is hers. Um, so now we just wait and see if she pops up. Okay, there's some people up there calling me. Alright. Cool guys, let me follow these kids and I'll see you guys there. My word, how's that for a house number? House number 022070. Wonder why there's a zero in the front. Like, what's the purpose of that? Oops. One way road, car approaching. Now, why would you have a huge stone like that in the middle of where? cars have got to go so I've just gone and reversed into it now and I really hope I haven't damaged my car okay guys let's hope the snake is still here I would hate to have come all this way at my expense reversed into a rock damaged my car wasted my time wasted my petrol and there's no snake so, let's hope for the best, yeah. Let's go look. Okay, so they've just told me now they didn't sleep in this house last night. They slept over there. This room and it turn right, it get under the small bed there. Okay. I even left it to the light off the, uh, the on like that. Okay. Run out. <laughs> so it went into this yes. bedroom, yeah. In this bedroom. Yeah, in this bedroom, yeah. 
under that bed. It went under that bed. The one on the left or the right? On the, on the, on the, on the right. right. On the right. Okay. On the right. Hey, I hope this snake is still here. I hope so. Because it had the whole night <laughs> to move around. The whole night and it was closed. Okay. And there's a big snake. It can't be here. There's no, no, no place. Other that bed is it's got a gap there. It's got a? A gap, yeah. yeah. Right here at the corner. In here? Uh, 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 yes, 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 I'm not seeing anything under that one either. Um. Where was the frog? That side. Okay. <laughs> So they've just seen a frog come darting out of here and I guess they're thinking that the frog was being chased by a snake or something, I don't know. So they think it's here. It never find a way out, it find a place to hide. Yeah, I, I hope so. <laughs> it never left here. Okay. Never left here. There's a frog. There's a frog. Oh, okay. Yeah, I heard the frog. It looked like I looked down the side of the bed. Oh, here it is. The mom, the guys. The mom's a big one. There he is. Well, that was lucky, because if this was a nocturnal snake, like a spitting cobra or something, Stay there. then it would have cruised around all night. It like it ate, ate something. Yeah, I'm not sure, Maybe but it's, it's a big snake. Frog. No, this one doesn't eat frogs, but I think the frog will still be very scared of it. But this is a mom, but this only eats warm-blooded animals like rats, like rats. and birds and rabbits and chickens and... I just want to take this chair out. So I'm going to create some space. So what I want to do is get that chair out the way so that I can shift the bed across. Check it out this. 
think it's okay here. It's okay. I didn't even go to work because <laughs> my keys, everything is here. Yeah, let's see. It looks like this guy was moving towards the back here. No. Okay, so the mamba is under this bed, and I'm thinking that it might have a gap that sort of gets into the base. Maybe there's a hole in the base. Otherwise, he's just tucked himself under that gap there. I want to just take the mattress and the blankets off first. Let's just wrap it all up together. Take it all one time. Oh. Can't get that off there. Oh, it's hooking. Yeah, it's hooking there, I don't know why. Let's try use the grab stick. There we go. Okay. This is what she doesn't come out here by your feet. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm making okay. a big job here, but okay. stick it out. Yeah, it's just so that I can work safely here. Thanks. Okay. So there now should be a snake when I move this base. There should be a snake here now. This looks like a very big mamba guys, it looks like at least a 2.7 I would say. Very much aware that something's happening. It's fine, he's doing what snakes do. They just want to get away, they want to hide. Hello. I heard a movement that sounded like he completely left the area. He has done just that. But where he went, I don't know. Okay, he's obviously shifted through that gap there. And that means he's back in the bedroom. Or 
to get some more. Ah, gosh. So difficult without a cameraman. I've got to keep on shifting the camera and finding a place to stand it where it can balance. No, it's good. I need some air. <laughs> Why don't you look at that? He left him a nice deposit during the night. That is Mamba Poo. It's got a very, very distinct smell. It smells like a bit like curry, celery, um, pickled fish, a combination of those three smells. Okay, no more messing around, no more chasing snake from A to B. The room is so small that it's difficult to move an ob object from one part of the room to another. You know, just to get it out the way. So I can have some space to move. Snake is just below me, yeah. Where are you going to? Gosh, this thing's going under the bed. looked to me like this bed was sitting flush on the floor but it has got little feet <laughs> the snake has gone under so it has gone under this bed here Look, it's going back. Okay, he's going back to that corner. I've just transferred most of the stuff from this bed to this bed so that I can lift this bed and now the snake is under this bed <laughs> it's just that there's quite a bit of stuff in this room everything is on top of one another sorry <laughs> I'm gonna try minimize the stuff in this room so I've got a bit more space to work because at the moment he's just going from one spot to another. Let's get this chair out.
me just check that he's still under here. Shifted once again. Tongs on him, guys. Perfect condition. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Let me guess, you're a girl. They're all girls lately. In the past, I used to catch like 10 or 12 males for every one female. And in the last sort of year or so, I'm just catching girls. There's like no boys around. All girls at the moment for some reason, and like hardly any boys. This is most definitely. A girl. She's about she's about 2.6, 2.7 meters. Yeah. Okay, let's take the snake out so we can bag it safely where we've got some room. Get some pictures before I take it. Are you taking a video or picture? I'm taking a video. Okay. So, 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 Jason, how, how did it get in? Like, how did it, it must have got in either through a window or a door. Or a door. Maybe during the, the heat of the day, maybe it was just looking for a it place. It might be during oh, the heat of the day. Yeah, it was yeah. looking for a cool place to hide. Cool place, yeah, I think so. Because the door is too small when it's closed. The gap small. Yeah. Maybe find the doors open. Then it's yeah. <laughs> I'm sure. Okay, Snake, we're going in the bag. We are going in the bag. Yeah, they never like going into the bag, these things. <coughs> Maybe you can help me because I've got the, the head here. Okay. I've got the head in this corner. In this corner. You, can, you can just sh shove the body inside the bag. Strong, eh? It's my first time touching this thing. No. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. 
Come on, Snake, you've still got some space to go under. Yeah, here's a head. That side. This is Mamba. I found you a new home. Bye.